Welcome What's up, everyone? My name is Justice X, and welcome to the third episode of my Assassin's Creed Rogue playthrough. Let's get into it. I'm really enjoying this game so far. I just, ooh. After this one, I've got to play Unity. And then when the new one comes out, Syndicate, I'm definitely getting it. To. Whatever Templar affairs lead us. Liam, it's not like you to set out without a plan. Plan or no plan. We choose our own battlefield. And hey, you're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right, you are. Let's set sail. Most of these videos are recorded days in advance before they're actually released. This episode in particular, which is being recorded the day that the first episode should be uploaded to my channel, is, <coughs> oh, excuse me, is the first day of E3, and I am excited, well, first or second, I'm not too sure. It's Bethesda's day at E3, basically, him. and for that's us, what I'm excited much more for, because of Fallout 4. Liam, do you know what the Keelys writes about? I see him in his office all the time, bent over almost his noon, and I am he just records and accounts. tiny so bit of is known about the peace of the going. And of course, he corresponds to the Assassin's Creed uh, Conference. Of course. See the information they're going to release. You could be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as it's you. I cannot help but the Achilles wants me to be familiar you know with our counterparts care. in Europe and elsewhere. Your restricted area can Said like his favorite yourself. son. Connor's his favorite and only son. Then Achilles is there. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. You call me that again. Throw you in the ocean. Now we're bound to the Arctic throughout. Rolling town to the whole Maui. Rolling town to the whole Maui. Me boys, rolling town to the whole Maui. We're outward bound to the Arctic throughout. Rolling home to the whole Maui. And we've troubled that stormer. Some shipwrecked cargo here. Yep. But yeah, while well, we're out here sailing, I want to take this time to say, if you guys have been enjoying the episodes so far, let me know now in the comment section below. Leave a comment, tell me what you enjoyed, tell me what you have enjoyed, tell me what you think I could do better, tell me what you want to see more of, all that good stuff. Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the thousand francs. Ah, the cabbage farmer has returned. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'd be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it. Imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our ally has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship. I 
How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers, Shay. When the time comes, they will end aid and help us fight the Templars. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we meet? You need not worry about your chauffeur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and English fleets. And he knows more about what goes on in his parts than you can imagine. Ooh, that was cool. You tell me about our Diwali. You obviously admire the man. I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who'd done so much for our cause. So much more than that. Adewale was already a legend before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate. A scourge of the West Indies. Rubbing elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Ruth Rogers, and Calico Jack Rackham. Calico who? Oh, read a book, will you? About 20 years ago, Adewale intercepted a Templar convoy and stole a mysterious package. He traveled to Port-au-Prince and entrusted it to a woman he believed was loyal to our cause. English vessel, and she looks to be in trouble. That's why you're here. Perhaps you should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. Now let's not be too hasty. She's full of crown cargo. Take a look for your spyglass and see for yourself. Please don't destroy it. Okay. Hold your fire. Don't want to sink her. Now's the time. Let's board her. Move up. Leave this deck. Show them what's for, Captain. Come on, man. Fires are on. Oof. Put them uh, over again. I have little cannons like on uh, as you see. Sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the Morgan before going any further. There's a harbor master station nearby. We should spend our new wealth on improvements. I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes. Antoine Lacandal is their mentor. He gathers many of his assassins from the Maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. It's a shame, though. They escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in that earthquake. But Haiti's a French colony now. Aye, it is. And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French own the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Our struggle is beyond political borders, Shay. Small fishing village. Is this the place? Lots of fishermen and their gear. Aye, fur say and fishing go hand in hand. But it will serve our purposes well enough. French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. Yeah. 
Service, can I provide? You can provide the service of upgrading that ship. Here's an idea. Thanks for your trust, Captain. All right, everyone, I feel like this is a nice place to cut this episode off, simply because we're in, like, a nice little spot that we can just talk for a second and end it. Um, actually, you know what? No, I'm going to finish this mission first. Disregard that. Captain Cormac, get that You can resume course to Anticosti, Captain. Indeed. The chasseur is waiting for us. The sea between here and Anticosti is rough, Captain. The Morrigan seems sturdy enough for the challenge. We're clear, Captain. Ships ahoy! More fishermen from Perse. Enemy ship! They're sinking the fishing boat. You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. These scoundrels must pay. And would you look at that? Right in our way, can't cross it. What say you? Sick every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. here for a reason, Shay. Mind your duty. But what's the point of freedom? You cannot breathe deep and enjoy it. The temperate state of this continent like a car. Don't feel liberated until we fry them all. 
Seems to me we should just talk to them like men instead of skulking around. forget and we have nothing in common with that of course there it is Articus. the chasseur should be there and with any luck he will know where to find that manuscript mm. he's off the way dock the ship here captain we've arrived at anticosti island Go on ahead, Shay. We will meet you at the fort. We'll make it. goes the fur trip. Take a look at this. I borrow these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Sheikh Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you see. It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings, plants, and animals out of an opium drain. There's no charts, no, no, no maps? No. There may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the host thieves could get Where is the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington who sent it in. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay. Let's return and find him. You, sir, have our thanks. Alrighty, everyone. That mission's complete. It's time for this episode to end. Sorry for earlier, the false alarm of ending it. I was just going to end it there, but... I figure I might as well complete the mission. That's done. This was episode 3. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and a comment. My Twitter and my Twitch links are in the description below. Until next time, see ya.